My number five is Johnny Depp. Really only for Jack Sparrow. Not a good runner. Obviously not a good runner, but it is a memorable run. The most, the most memorable movie run since Jim Carrey. I will say, I will, I will agree with you that he that it is known. Uh, he's actually on my honorable mention. Uh, Harrison Ford from Raiders of the Lost Ark. Oh, yeah. I mean, he was awesome as Indiana Jones. I mean, if you haven't seen those movies, specifically Raiders of the Lost Ark, which you should because they are amazing. They're fantastic. Um, my number four is all from one movie franchise. I think there's a lot of good candidates for it. But ultimately, my number four is Carl Weathers. He was an effortless runner. The other one I could put from that franchise is Dolph Lundgren. Remember in Rocky IV where he's running around the track and you're like, oh, he's running. Stallone looked like a guy trying to run. Carl Weathers and Dolph Lundgren look like athletes. Uh, but my number three is Tom Hanks from Forrest Gump. I didn't have it on my list, but I thought about it really hard. Now, which running scene, though, do you remember the most? Do you remember the one with him as a kid? The one with him as a football player? The one with him running across country? It would for sure be the uh, where he's running across country, and it's raining, and the person gives him the T-shirt. Mm. He's muddy. My number three is Tom Cruise. I, I didn't put him on my list for the for the fact that he. I, I don't think he looks like a cool runner. Like no one no. actually runs like that. There is a level of intensity or trying too hard that no one who's a good runner actually looks like that. Tom Cruise <laughs> runs like a person acting like they can run. He doesn't run like someone who can actually run. I know this isn't going to make any sense. But I, I'm going to stand by it. And my number two is going to be Brad Pitt from Troy. Specifically, the fighting scene with him and Eric Bana, where they're running around each other. Hmm. I don't remember it at all, and I've seen that movie, which to me automatically should signify that it shouldn't even be on the list. Yeah, I, I wouldn't. I wouldn't necessarily say it's a running scene. It's more of an athletic scene. My number two is Chris Evans. Oh, well, I should have known. He's a good runner. Who's your number one going to be? Rocky. Which movie? But the first, the original montage, the best running scene for him solo. You know, when he's running through the streets and his sweats and he runs up the steps and, you know, starts punching at the air, you know, blah, blah, blah. My difficulty with putting Sylvester Stallone in that particular movie high is that when he walks out of the house... He jumps over the railing, which no person okay. would actually do. You wouldn't jump over the railing. And that just sets the tone for the whole thing being like, it's not, that's not accurate. You're not jumping over the railing. You're going to walk down the steps. You're going to warm up a little bit. You got to watch your knees. You got to take care of your body. <laughs> so he's not taking care of his body. I, I mean, I stand by, I think it's, you have to at least admit, I mean, you have it on your list, that it's one of the top five iconic running roles in cinema history. I don't think that he's the best runner in that series. My number one is Robert Patrick. The T-1000 or whatever his number is, I think that he is hands down the best runner in movies. Because he looked like someone, he looked like somebody who, number one, could run. Number two, he was going to catch you. Okay, who's in your honorable mention? <laughs> uh let's see uh so like i said any any tom cruise movie uh matthew broderick from uh ferris bueller the run that he did in that movie was oh that's a good run uh brendan frazier in the mummies uh and then i have uh daniel craig from his uh james bond movies that he did a little stiff but i think that that was also part of the character i had laura dern running in jurassic park that's fine, I guess, but I'd rather have Jeff Goldblum, I think. <laughs> uh, I have one that I can't remember the guy's name. I keep wanting to say Leonard Nimoy, but that's not his name. He played Spock in one of the recent Star Treks. You're like, oh, Zachary Chris... Quinto? He could run. Should... You're like, oh, he's got, <laughs> some, he's got some skills at running. <laughs> 